10 Caesars by Barry Strauss. So it is about the Caesars of the Roman Empire. Roman Empire is from Augustus to Constantine. So obviously for this one, each Caesar gets their own chapter. So it isn't dealing with like, here's a chapter on war and here's what like the Caesars wars look like. You get a chapter on each and at the beginning of each chapter you get like some sort of like bust or coin showing what they would have possibly lo looked like because like sometimes it might be an exa exaggeration of what they might look like. <laughs> so he doesn't talk about um, like I said he doesn't merge the Caesars into like separate categories like war, life, um, politics or whatever. They each get their own type of chapter. You get, you do get a little bit of like influence or um, merge at the beginning or at the end leading up to the next one but that's most or like a slight reference back to a previous Caesar. Um, you do get a chronology, a chronolog chronologically line of the emperors, um, like the length of their reign and everything, and you do get a few maps as well, because it, it'll talk about a few different places. It'll talk a few, but two places, and so um, the map is a nice reference point. Um, so. You do get um, a bit of a biography on each. You are looking at a good few dozen pages on each. Um, give or take a few pages depending on the amount of information that the author wants. I don't want it to put in for them or the, describing um, certain things. So you are looking at like different situations um, people who made who made them who they were or certain wars or um, interactions like um, with Augustus Anthony and Cleopatra <laughs> kind of situation so um, you get that and you do get quite um, uh, a bit of information from like basically birth to death about them so um, like for me, it can use, this can easily be used as a university textbook as well as somebody um, from the general, like not general public, but anybody who has an interest in the Roman Empire or just like Roman leaders. This would be a book that anybody from post-secondary to high school to whoever has an interest in it. Um, so. You are getting an introduction to each with some primary sources at the front and back. Um, so, and I'm just like, I'm not much of a classics person, but um, like to me, I think um, easily it's, this is, could be just a good jumping off point to the 10 men and like, with Augustus alone, you're bound to fa find many, many books about him <laughs> or like interpretations about him. And and I'm assuming for a few others, um, you can find a few um, books about, I think um, maybe like one or two, not a whole lot more. Um, it all depends, like, again, I'm not a total classics person, so I could be wrong with the amount of, like, books and articles written about them, but certain ones may have more written about them than the others, but <laughs> all of, like, favoritism, I guess. But anyway, um, again, it's a good jumping off point for anyone who has an interest in uh, Roman leaders, Roman history, or if you're taking a classics or a Roman course in uh, school. So yeah, 10 Caesars, happy readings.